Hi everybody, welcome to my inference on a vlog. Um, so today's the full moon in Taurus. It's really, really powerful because there's all sorts of astrological aspects and um, a good person to go check out is the Leo King. He's on Facebook and in the app store and he's very in-depth astrologer and he'll give you the whole overview of that full moon and all the transits but I wanted to let everybody know that it's intense you know that that the full moon energy is super intense today and it's all about really following your heart I think because this Venus retrograde in Scorpio is all about getting deep to what you really need in your life you know like what do I need in my life to make me feel happy? What do I need in my life to make me feel abundant? What do I need in my life to make me feel whole? And looking inside for all that stuff as opposed to outside is a really big part of releasing a lot of those emotions and things from the past that cause us anxiety and problems in our current life. I also heard something today which was really profound. It was a doctor on, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sweating, it's 133 degrees in here already, and um, whoo, it's starting to drip. Anyway, so this thing I heard today was amazing, and I it really rang true for me, which is that whatever you experienced in the first seven years of your life is what will manifest in 95% of the rest of your life. So it's the, the, the basis of all of your programming from the beginning and it just, it manifests. So the only way to get out of that previous programming is to get into a theta state with theta waves and also repetition. So we basically have to reprogram ourselves so that we don't repeat the programming that we got from zero to seven. However, if you got great programming, you're really happy with that, keep it. But you can reprogram that through theta waves, which is a wavelength that you can listen to. You can go on like um, YouTube and find some theta wave reprogramming sounds. Um, and meditate while you're listening to those and repeat mantras of positive affirmations that you want to reprogram your brain with. And you have to repeat and repeat and repeat because at this stage in the game, the brain, it takes a long time to get out of previous repetitions, okay? So that's huge. And I'm going to work on that. And there's another thing that I just came across that is a powerful tool for changing all of that programming as well and you get into a deep meditative state with theta waves you don't have to use theta waves but you can and I'm sure it would make it like much more intense and and um, immediate is to go back in your life through all these um, experiences that were say negative in some way and which have colored your life going forward like the relationships or whatever money whatever and basically, you recreate the scene in your mind in great detail. And just use your imagination to create in your mind these scenes that you experienced that when you actually experienced them as a child or whatever were negative, but now recreate them in the positive. And you literally, if you do this when you're in a meditative state, you can literally change your past, which will according to this new information that I got today of the first seven years being your programming, change your present in your future. Okay, so that's huge. Oh my God. I'm doing that right now. That's my next thing to do. So I thank you all for listening. I so send blessings of love and, and abundance and thanks and gratitude. <laughs>